as we were talking back there, and I told you about the Voice of America incident in 2017, where they cut off a live interview for the first time in the station's history with the founder of our movement, Mao Zedong, when he was about to expose the CCP. Now, ma'am, Voice of America is funded by taxpayer money, ma'am. Now, how does that make you feel? You know, and when if you become the senator of New from New Jersey, what will what will you do to com confront situations like this? Well. Um, as a senator, once sitting there, I'm totally in favor of all the policies which our taxpayer money goes to protect our country, to the movement has to be protect in favor of our family and kids, and I am completely against any movement which take our religions, our freedom, take our, uh, unprotect our kids. So our kids has to be respect. It's your future, you're so young. So I'm here to work for you in America for your future generation. As a Chinese descendant, you're gonna raise your kids here. So your kids, your American kids, deserve the same rights because America was found by immigrants so we have to respect that that's my goal that's my principle CCP has no rights CCP is dividing America Absolutely. do not allow CCP divide America America it's not a country of communism CCP is supposed to be out of America Chinese people it's not CCP we are Americans we protect Americans and all immigrants which protect America and respect the Constitution. If you are Chinese and want to be in our country, respect America, follow all the path, come over here to grow as all the immigrants found America. That's what we need. Hey, yeah.